guess Kyrie stand in Boston, huh? I guess so. You could bounce back from this, Rosier. All you gotta do is pray. Slight. But to me, MJ's still the go. Go, go, go. Just go. like we the ghosts. It's a hell of a beat, Venom. Uh, can't stand the pedal, man. Hey, hey. At the end of the day, in my dream, Lose. I see that the, the me. black man is actually the uh, most. Come and stay I feel tonight. like the black I'm woman is the most vicious man. Man. And I feel like you the black man is the most endangered person. And that's what I'm in my vision. If you keep it true, then I I've been in trouble. 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 I've been in like a step of school yeah. It's a step up from anything you ever had A lot more to bring to the table Than just a bag Street nigga that still kept his head And some shit she I agree with her, of course we know But it's still, I blame men at the end of the day I don't care what y'all do Women can do the most of the shit It's always gonna come back to us That we supposed to believe You know what I'm saying? A lot of shit, we, we allow that one thing Men entertain women that you know, don't do this. So men, we gotta do that. And leave. And that's hard because you don't see what's going on. You see what's going on. I get it. Now, now I finally get it. This shit is different. Come <laughs> <laughs> That shit don't leave you feel. I think I learned that when you're smoking more. The weed ain't as good. Yeah, you know that like when that weed good, you ain't smoking as much. You don't have to. Yeah. Long so long better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. Like if you by yourself and you got that shit, you put that you put that motherfucker out. You ain't gotta face the jail with that. I mean, yeah, you ain't got. You can put that jail out. Mm -hmm. Come back. Awesome. I've been hitting struggle J's lately. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't run the table. That look like her. Yeah. She was like, I want this Beyonce move. That look like her. So, you just start with your right. We all supposed to be seeking to be righteous at the end the only way to really get to this is the truth. But we dealing with the world, they got so much poison that just confuse us, so much shit to entertain us, so much shit. So we getting off of truth. Look at a lot of our women. A lot of our women so insecure because of life. It's a lot of fake going on. A lot of fake. It's a lot of fake. Mm -hmm. I feel like we got to lead in truth. Whatever that means, I think that's our job. Whatever the truth is, that's what we got to do with our women. And a lot of times it'd be hard for us to sacrifice our wants. You know, that want get in the way. <laughs> but I can't, that's a hard question to really answer, to be honest. That's a hard one. Oh, I need yeah, to learn. I don't know it's, not, it's not that hard. It's whatever you feel leadership is. It's just it's when you did, and it's more serious. It's just perfect. That's all leadership. Yeah, when you act and stuff breaks down, however, leadership is definitely just that when you're not breaking your energy, making sure you're positive, making sure you're at peace within yourself, making sure you build yourself up. So if you like dancing, you dance, then your heart fall out. Mm -hmm. And people are going to believe in that confidence, and they're going to think like, oh, that's what I want to do. If you like giving back to people, then you're going to go, and you're going to go with it. And people are going to notice, like, oh, that's what I like to do. Like, my little brother is them, and I never used to notice it until recently. They be like, Nina, you don't understand how much we look up to you. Like, I want to go to America, and they don't really know what America is. They just know, like, I went there, and I was able to get away, and I was building this, and I was able to travel for free. Like, they know, like, I did that. They know that I left home, and I'm doing good now. So in my mind, like, you just do what you supposed to do to be happy. You living your truth. Yeah, example. Living your truth, and as long as you're living in your truth, people are going to want to be around you and follow that. That energy. Yeah, like, some people have that power.
Oh, yeah, you, oh, you can't be, you gotta they be crucial. always They away. crucial. They'll try to drain your energy. I'm gonna do that Let me buy that shit. Look at Wu-Tang Clan. Them niggas love each other, but look at their business. Look at that shit you heard Ghostface say. He mad that the nigga set up the two million dollars, and Ghostface is one of my favorite artists. He set up a deal, and you told him he shouldn't get no money? Come on, bruh. That, that don't even make sense. Like I tell people all the time. You're not gonna stay? NWA. Growing up, they made you think easy was the bad guy. The movie showed. When these niggas was dead, broken naked, Easy had the money. He did it. Now they feel like they're supposed to be. Come on, respect the game. He put up the money. He's the guy. Why can't you respect that he's the guy? You respect the white man being the guy? <laughs> Dr. Dre ain't challenged Jimmy Yadin, but you gonna fuck with Easy because he's the bro. So the bro know, bruh. You are the bro. This is business. You heard right really is a bro with Andre Young. But Easy and Dr. Dre, that shit is a business. And I don't I get it, you know that, that shit is fucked up. Cause that shit they fucked up legacies. NWA legacy was cut short because niggas couldn't do business. Nah, for real. And I think it'd be ego, cause I think shit could be I ain't saying easy is perfect. But I believe, bruh, we got this idea, just hit me out. It's just you mad that a nigga making a decision. What did he do? He's just doing business with his Jew man. And it made sense to me. Look, Jerry Heller is got it. He's a Jew. He has Hollywood connection. His number is 20% off the top. That's one you gave me. You pocket one. Well, he got to get 20. We doing the work. Fuck the work. You need distribution. You need access. But you want to just be a nigga around the way, man. You around the way. It's just like niggas, bro. For real. That's worth 20% to get me in the door. I think... I give Ice Cube credit. Later on in life, he looked back and said, I respect easy, I learned business. He let you know, I wasn't saying it was a difference of, and that's why I respect, cause he left, he a man, I ain't saying he gotta stay. He left, and was cool, but the movie let you know that when he left and he came in the jump with the bets, easy didn't fuck him. The white man that told him to go be easy, fuck him. That's who fuck you, Ice Cube. Shake your gloves, yeah.